How are you not mad at me, Paul? Maybe things could have ended differently and you wouldn't be in that stupid chair. RJ, we've talked about this. It wasn't your fault. You're not the only one that ran the light. But you were the only one that got hurt. That's what I'm saying. Come on, the doc said it'll be better in a few weeks and... I mean, come on, man, don't beat yourself up. I guess you're right, but that doesn't make it any better. I remember everyone making fun of you. Why don't you ever say anything to them? Why? Because I'm in a wheelchair? I don't really care. I don't have to worry about it much longer anyway. Hey man, are you feeling any better? Yeah, I'm fine. I'm just tired of people making fun of Paul. It's okay, really. Let's just drop him, man. Yeah, what happened to Paul was tragic. He's gonna be fine, though. Yeah. Seriously? What's your problem? My problem? It's funny coming from you. What? Can you believe these people? It's okay, it happens. Whatever. I'm gonna be late for class. Meet me here after school. Alright, I'll see you later, man. Don't you ever get tired of that? Tired of what? The attention Paul brings to you. What are you trying to say? I'm saying maybe we need to stop hanging out with him. How could you say that? He's our best friend. Maybe it's time to move on. I can't believe you, Phil. Whatever, dude. Hey, get off of him! It's not like we're bothering him anyway, freak. Losers. <laughs> 